Well, you've probably seen her before. Mu Dang is the baby pygmy hippopotamus from Thailand who's been charming the world with her signature sassy antics online. But did you know you can see a family of pygmy hippos just like hers in Boston? The Franklin Park Zoo is home to Cleo, Innocencio, and little Ptolemy. WBZ's Mike Sullivan introduces us to the family getting new attention thanks to their cousin abroad. It's social media's newest darling, Meet Mu Dang. The baby pygmy hippo first captured the hearts of gawkers at her zoo in Thailand. Then she devoured the World Wide Web faster than a head of lettuce. We are really excited that people are excited about pygmy hippos in general because they're a species that doesn't always get a lot of attention. Locally, we have a similar star. This is Ptolemy. Four years ago, he was born at the Franklin Park Zoo. As you can imagine, he had similar fanfare. He was just as, as cute, if not cuter, I will say myself. Baby pygmy hippos are just, you know, they're so small and like they love to run around and be silly. Erica Farrell is the assistant curator of the tropical forest at the zoo. That's where you will find Ptolemy, along with his mother and father. There's probably only about 2,500 to 3,000 left in the wild, and that is a, an estimate. They live in West Africa. Farrell says their habitat is shrinking as people expand onto their land. When I think of hippos, I think of big hippos, big jaws. Yep. These are little guys. Yeah, so you're thinking of their cousin, the river hippo, which is quite different. So they live in big groups, um, big family groups and big open areas. While they still weigh 400 to 500 pounds, it's their smaller stature that gives pygmies their cute label, the type of adjective that breeds internet fame. There are not a ton of on the ground conservation efforts um, for pygmy hippos. Farrell hopes Mu Dang's recent exposure will spark more efforts to save the endangered species worldwide. In Boston, I'm Mike Sullivan, WBZ News.